Got a Nintendo 64. Gentlemen, this is... What is up everyone, it's Adam from FWCI and today I'm going to be trying my first movie reaction. So I'm not sure how the rules work around editing and uploading and stuff, so I may end up uploading this one 30 years after I finish recording it. So, <laughs> hello people of the future! So I've chosen to watch a movie that I've actually seen before, in fact I've seen this movie many, 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 many times before. This was my first VHS video that I ever owned as a child. So this movie got played on repeat throughout years and years of my childhood. The movie is Cool Runnings. If you've never seen it, please definitely go watch it yourself before you watch me react to it. It is an absolutely amazing movie. And uh, yeah, I'm keen to watch this. I haven't seen it in probably a good 15 years. But like I say, I watched it literally hundreds of times throughout my childhood. So uh, it's a movie that's very close to my heart. So let's have a look. Cool Runnings Man. By the way, Jamaican accent's incoming. It's gonna be unavoidable. Let's get into it. Rise above it. <laughs> I love this song. I could watch that backside all day. <laughs> <laughs> you heavy old woman. <laughs> I always enjoyed uh, Leon, the actor from this. I always enjoyed his work in Above the Rim, which is another awesome old movie about basketball. Ah, so good. But that character's no Doris Banak. All right. Let's do it, One, Sanka. Two, three, two, three. Who's, Who's the, the captain, captain of our group? Who's, Who's the friend to me and you? you? Kind of nice, good looking too. too. Sanka, 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 yeah, Sanka. Sanka. <laughs> Get back to work. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the big hot bag of man who doesn't right. like the comb who doesn't bathe and, and doesn't, doesn't care? care. Sanka! Sanka! Hey, Sanka! Hey! What's happening, oh, Star? Man. Where you been? Hey, you know what my grandfather said? What? Get back Get to back work! Get back to work! <laughs> 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 oh. This movie is already making me feel just very internally happy. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I love all of these characters. I love everything. He's a lazy, crazy, sorry, no good bugaboo. <laughs> bugaboo? So what you laughing at? It sounds like a slur. Wow, you know what? I just realized I don't think I've ever watched this with the, um, with the subtitles on, so I'm probably going to pick up quite a bit that I never have. You know, with the accents and everything, and me being a kid, probably not knowing a lot of words that were used. The rhythm. The yeah. Get on up. It's push guard time. Sanka Kapi! Can someone explain to me why they need to have a child on the front of these rickety push carts that are hurtling down this hill? <laughs> this looks so fucking dangerous. I think in Jamaica, the number one cause of death, push cart races, number two is like smoking. Say the line, Doris. Sanka, you dead? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> a little concerned about that big baldy. <laughs> Yo, Brenna. Oh, he's so intense. Hey, good luck to you too. <laughs> Take your mark. I think Sanka was always my favorite character as a kid, but so far I'm, I'm enjoying Yul Brenna. <laughs> and he hasn't even said a word. <laughs> Ah, uh, Junior. You fucking idiot. That is such a great, like, way to shoot that moment with, like, you can see it, like, you can live it through the eyes of Doris's girlfriend. Like, you can really see her expression go from, like, yes to, like, no, no! Ah. Who's the other man in the picture with my father? Oh, Irving Britzer. He's an American who So is that there. really a picture of John Candy, or...? Are you sure this man, he lives on the island? Mate, oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Coolis, thanks a lot. Good to Just one more thing. Mm. What's a bobsled? That's a bobsled. That's a bobsled. That's a bobsled. We push car with no wheels. <laughs> oh, so a bobsled is a push cart with no wheels. That's what it looks like here. Let me see <laughs> that. <his> <laughs> oh, this is so good. All right, 
The key elements for a successful sled team are a steady driver and three, three strong, strong runners to push off down, down the ice. Ice! <laughs> ice! <laughs> ice. <laughs> El, it's kind of a winter sport. <laughs> you mean winter as in ice. I'm gonna take a hot bath. I'm getting cold oh. just thinking about all this ice. No, man! You're gonna be part of my bobsled team. What do you need me for? I'm shocked at how fucking awesome Darice is in this movie. I always kind of thought him to be like kind of the straight man, but he is just, he is so funny, his delivery of all these lines. You'll be part of my bobsled team! Bad <laughs> Tumbleweed, what are you doing? Tumbleweed, can't hold it. Fucking hell, Tumbleweed. I need this one! Please! Come on! Here they come! No! Yes! No! Yes! <laughs> This is my teammate, Sanka Kaf. Greetings, Sled God. <laughs> sled God. You were just wondering. <laughs> Your father was one of the toughest competitors I ever saw. He ran 100 meters in 10 flat. But I run it to 9-9. Nine, nine. <laughs> I'm really impressed with how good John Candy is in this, like... It's not a... This is a comedy movie, but he plays a fairly... Serious, dramatic sort of role, especially at the start. <laughs> I love this scene. Gentlemen, a bobsled is a simple thing. Yes, yeah, so's a toilet! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Candy's Basically reaction. what you're looking at is always remember your bones will not break in a bobsled. No, no, no. no. They, they shatter. shatter. <laughs> Meeting starts yet? Uh oh. Uh oh. You! Kill you. Say hello to the first Jamaican bobsled team. Oh, good. <laughs> we agreed that it's time to get on with your real future, right? I know. Right? The subtlety is not the strength of this movie. <laughs> the characters are very, very... Stereotypical, I guess. He's the stereotypical rich boy. Yul Brenner's got like the cut off sleeves because he's a stereotypical bad dude in like Disney's, like, you know, as far as Disney movies go, I suppose. Old enough? <laughs> <laughs> Who owns this thing? We do, sir. <laughs> Who are you? The Jamaican bobsled team, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Do the words give up mean anything to you? Not a thing. Not a thing. <laughs> Some people say you know they can't believe to make a way of a Bob said team. Badass to keep it chewing. Oh, that's right. We can't accept this money. It just wouldn't be proper. Fuck that. Take uh, the money, Doris. Yes. One Doris <laughs> and the one Junior. You. Sanka. The fastest of the fastest of Jamaican sprinters Respect Go to Olympics, fight for Jamaica Ah, damn I thought it was the Respect to Man of Blitzer one <laughs> Psycho Man, what you smoking? I'm not smoking, I'm breathing <laughs> <laughs> That's a line that makes a lot more sense to me now. Son, come on, what you smoking? <laughs> so my favorite scene in this that I'm looking forward to seeing again is the build up to the bar fight they have against the, the Swiss, I think it is. Um, just the, the dialogue in that just always resonated with me and always stuck with me throughout my whole life. So uh, can't wait to see it. Uh, register for tryouts. What country? Uh, Jamaica. What country? Jamaica. So, um, this movie, I never, it, you know, I never watched it through this lens as a child, but it's very clearly a, a movie about, like, you know, racism and stuff like that. Once they get to Canada and to the Olympics, they don't address it as, like, you know, really legitimate racism. It's just like, oh, you don't belong here because you're from Jamaica, which is like a hot island country and this is the winter olympics and you're out of your your place isn't here but going back and 
just that there and like remembering like how some of the the interactions and stuff happen going back through this movie could be uh kind of um a, a little bit of a different experience three of these guys can run the hundred in under 10 flat i don't care who you are that's lightning yeah but can lightning run on ice all right, the sugar-coated track stars, <laughs> move out and let the ice rust and sugar so it's done. track stars. Oh! Ah! She's beautiful. Doris is so overwhelmed by this whole experience. It's kind of inspiring to see him just, you know, absorb and just submerge himself in this new sport because he's just that driven to get the Olympic gold medal. It's, uh, it's, still, it's a very cool story, arc that this movie has. I don't want you to worry about looking good out there. Ah, Blitzy. You're going to tuck Sam in too? Look at this cool <laughs> bully. Hey, seem into you like nobody well, likes us. They're on top We're different. You. People are always afraid of what's different. <laughs> good job. Hey, coach. Yeah. I can't get my helmet down. Oh, thanks, coach. Fuck it out. That's what I'm here for. This is embarrassing. That other guy looks like George Harrison. I hope you don't mind keeping quiet while I catch up on my reading. <laughs> what are you talking about reading? You see me? I'm different. Because I know exactly oh, where I'm no. going. Oh, I remember this now. And after I, Yul Brenner, win the Olympics. Oh, where's he going to go? It's somewhere famous. that doesn't exist. I'm going to leave the island. And live. Oh, the Buckingham right Palace. That's there. right. <laughs> Oh, you better get broken here. We're laughing about. That's Buckingham Palace. You plan on living there, you're gonna have to marry the Queen. <laughs> Yule, that's where the Queen of England lives. Oh. Face it, Yule, Brenner. You can start calling yourself Madonna, but you're still gonna end up in an hotel shanty like every other dark working nobody. That's a. That's rough from Sunka there. He's a bit of an asshole in this scene. And this is another very sweet moment between Yul Brenner and Junior after, like, you know, the tension. For such a, like, ho hum Disney kids movie, this is so well written and such a great story. I feel like in reality, though, Yul Brenner would have just kicked the shit out of Sanka right there and quit. <laughs> oh, Coolidge is not going to like this. Yeah, he's hating that. Having your gold medals taken away for cheating is a big deal. Perhaps I could dust your head. <laughs> Whatever's wrong with you is no little thing. <laughs> Hurry up, man. Have That's a, a dead great grandmother line. that moves. I think I better just do what he wants and go back home. And forget about your teammates. That's it. Blood fire. Get to the mirror in the men's room. Man, what should I do? What should I do? <laughs> hey, Jamaica! Keep it down. You are not owning this place. <laughs> you are not owning this sorry, place. Sorry, sir. Sorry. I... <laughs> Leave the Bob setting to the Leave the Bob setting to the real men. <laughs> Come on, you. That's it. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> I see pride. Can I hear you? I see power. I see a badass mother who won't take no crap off of nobody. So Once angry. again, I see pride. Junior, Junior, I see power. <laughs> I see a badass mother who won't take no crap off of nobody. That's very right. right. Oh, oh shit. Where are you going? Junior, you, you just amped up on the speech. Calm down. <laughs> Oh no. I just realized this movie is like a movie that always makes me cry at the end when they're carrying the sled. Fuck. <laughs> Fucking hell. Alright. I got some tissues. I freeze in this. <laughs> yeah, you will, mate. The Alliance has decided to change the qualifying time from a minute two to a minute flat. Is that clear? What the fuck? No problem, man. <laughs> oh, that's great. I'm already tearing up at this point, I'm not gonna lie. Ah! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Such shit, man. <laughs> so what are we gonna name this sled? How about Tallulah? <laughs> Tallulah. <laughs> That's like a two dollar hooker. <laughs> How you come up with that? <laughs> That's my mother's name. I like Tallulah. Tallulah. Like Tallulah. <laughs> we must also be concerned about the potential for embarrassment. Oh, forgive me. I didn't realize the four black guys in a bobsled could make you blush. I think we've heard <laughs> enough. Come on, Kurt. What you're what doing is. is wrong. Oh, they said we're back in. <laughs> Our father, Wart in Calgary, bobsled be thy name. <laughs> thy kingdom come, gold medals won. You know, when the Swiss, you know, when the Swiss one, oh, oh, you shut Swiss. up about the damn Swiss. Respect to the man, Irv Blitzer. <laughs> All right, gentlemen. Respect. 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 We now come to the second chance for the... I'm already fucking crying. It's not even at the end. Fuck. 56.53. Woo! Yes! Yes! Did you hear that, Tommy? Yes! 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 I should not have chosen this movie, by the way. Fuck it out. There are no flawless characters in this movie. Everybody has their... Except maybe Doris, I guess. But, you know, his flaw is his tenacity towards winning. But, you know, Blitzer has got the, the cheating thing. Um, Yul Brenner, like, he had his moment of, like, humiliation where he wanted to live in Buckingham Palace. You know, Sanka is not as, uh, you know, competitively minded as the other guys which comes through. It's a very, it's just such a cool movie to see that nobody in this movie is trying to, like, be like, yeah, and I'm this dude who's going to get everything right. Like, everyone in this is, is struggling, and uh, I think it makes the movie better. Well, my dear, we've got a team in the Olympics. Oh, don't now you're on board. The Jamaicans, they still have a chance to win an Olympic medal. Everybody shut up. My boys on TV. <laughs> Dreadlocks. Let me kiss your lucky egg. <laughs> Next team up is Jamaica. All right, fellas, that's us. Let's go. Here we go. Today's our day. Now the speed seems too much, and I don't think he's going to be able to hold it. Oh. <laughs> I could already feel it coming, by the way. It's not even at the set. There we go. <laughs> Fuck it up. I'm not crying, you're crying. Stop it. Stop crying. Oh, fuck. So good, Jamaica. Guy's Thank face. Four years, yeah? Yeah, man. Very good. The 
Jamaican bobsled team return to their country as heroes four years later return to the Olympics as equals. I always found that wording very weird when I was a kid. Oh man. So that was Cool Runnings. Man, I love that movie so much. I have not watched that in so long, which is too long. Um, I enjoy everything about that movie. Because I watched it so much as a kid, there is dialogue in that, that it's just been burned into my brain. And I've never let it go. Like, um, Sanka's mother, you better watch more than that. <laughs> that is something I've quoted many, many times. The, tell me what you see. <laughs> <laughs> just these little like nuggets of dialogue have just imprinted on me so much throughout my entire life. That was such a fun watch. Um, now comes the fun part of trying to edit it and put it up and everything like that. And yeah, there's a lot of undertones to that movie that back then, I guess it was like Disney doing like their G-rated, hey, this is a movie about like kind of prejudice and stuff like that. I always loved this movie growing up. And I think growing up in Australia, Australia has become a little bit more kind of, um, established like with like international sports and stuff like that like more so in the last like 10 years but back in the early 90s Australia like if we had we had one guy in the NBA that was Luke Longley and he was like a god he could have been Luke Longley for the Sacramento Kings who ended up last and we still would have hailed him as like the greatest athlete in all of Australian history so I think that helped me relate to the Jamaican aspect of it and you know, the people in the town kind of following along with it and the, the, the sense of community and the pride that they're holding to see somebody from, you know, their country go on to do something, you know, fantastic on a world stage. So I definitely related to that. That movie's fucking awesome. I can't say enough about it. But let me know what you guys think in the comments about Cool Runnings. And as always, everyone, feel the rhythm, feel the rhyme, get on up. It's Bobsled time. Peace.